welcome back sexy people um to the extended i decided to just hop right into the extended right after the reading because it's just important to me i really want to make sure that i'm giving my uh subscribers and supporters what they need what y'all need okay so let's see what else is going on in the situation okay there was something holding you back from coming together with this uh, other party that you're dealing with. I'm feeling like it could just be like a best friend, family member. Could be romantic, but I'm getting more best friend, family, family friend. You know, that kind of vibe, right? So let's see. Let's see. Business partner even, you know, just those kind of vibes. So what's keep, we're going to ask what's, what was keeping y'all apart, what brought y'all together, and what's the, what the next steps are for you guys. All right. So I got two cards that we started with, and I'm going to do two more cards to take us. Let's do one card for what kept y'all apart. What was the opposition that kept these parties apart? Highest Holy Spirit, Highest Holy Angels, and Masters. What was the thing that brought them together? What was that Empress energy? And what is the next thing happening for these two parties? Okay, so wow, 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 wow. Beautiful, beautiful, very, very dope. All right, I should have went and got some other cards, but you know what, it's okay, because we're just gonna work with what we got. Um, Cause y'all, I got this, I, I don't have on clothes in here. I'm not getting up and, and sitting back down and I'm not editing anything, okay? I love y'all, but I got so much to do, y'all. It don't even make no sense. Bear with you, girl. Okay, so what was keeping y'all apart, the opposition that was keeping you guys separate, you and the party that you're dealing with, uh, we got the kamikaze card, okay? So if you don't know what kamikaze is, you can Google it real quick, but I will tell you that it's basically a reference to a art like a, a army like war tactic where basically someone like basically drives a plane or something like that like it's basically a death mission like say for example it was just two 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 when i said that <laughs> so this is literally a direct channel so listen up all right but um it's like basically when somebody takes you down and they know that that they'll go down too if they're taking you down but they don't care so it's very malicious it's very low vibrational it's very dark and just whack but basically it's somebody saying i'm gonna take this person down even if i have to take myself down too right that's the energy so you might already know what that could be referring to but of course we're gonna pull tarot who is on this kamikaze mission and what is this kamikaze mission? I just heard it has something to do with the 144,000. I feel like you and this other entity, you and this other party are both chosen energies, okay? You're both the kind of energy that is supposed to change and influence the world somehow. And you are being kept apart by the natural opposition that exists within this realm, okay? Somebody knew that destroying this union would bring them some hell of a karma, pretty much, right? But they didn't care. They still did it. So I'm just curious to know if it's just like the natural order of things or what, what this Empress energy is. It's giving the natural order of things, like natural pushback, natural obstacles, natural challenges that we are meant to get over and overcome as, as beings, as people, so that we can evolve and ascend to where we're supposed to be. And I feel like the other party just wasn't doing the work like you were doing the work for a viewer. And that may have been the thing that kept them back. But let's see, let's see. What is this kamikaze energy? What was this oppositional energy that was keeping these parties apart? Okay, so the first thing that came out was Seven of Cups, right? I feel like in this situation, it was so much freedom. There was, I feel like I just heard, I just got, I just received, people were learning how to be adults, okay? I feel like whoever you had this relationship with, you guys may have known each other since you were younger, right? And I feel like there was always someone to tell y'all what y'all should do or how y'all should handle the situation or, you know, just always like a third like a out like a non-biased third party to tell you guys like what their opinion was who was wrong who was right you know that kind of thing i just saw four for four but i feel like you guys had so much space like an abundance of space and opportunity to either heal the situation or let it go how it's gonna go and people weren't because the responsibility was in somebody's like 
corner or like basically because the ball was in their court or it was their responsibility to fix this, I don't think that they were used to that and they weren't ready to like rise to that level of adulting if that makes sense with the seven of cups i feel like you guys could have had anything you wanted this situation and that's what made it hard it's like i don't know how to see a healthier i don't know what a healthier relationship looks like that's what i'm getting like somebody didn't know what a healthier relationship looked like what like how to get to that other side how the other side of that was gonna look you know what i'm saying they could have had it anyway but they didn't know how they wanted it pretty much or how to get there all right, six of pentacles. I'm, I'm getting that. Hmm, let's see, let's see, let's see, see, see. Hmm. I feel like somebody was giving all of their good stuff. Like the other party uh, in this equation could have been giving all of their good stuff. They could have been using their manifestation, their ability to to materialize what they want for bad. It's like if you can have anything, five, five, five. Literally, I just saw five, five, five. So I feel like this whole time, this person was falling victim to their lower self, pretty much, right? I feel like this person could have had anything, you know, and it, it takes a real responsible, mature person to say, oh, if I could have anything right now, I would have like a healthy family and healthy businesses with my family and, you know, better things like that puts me in a better position for the people around me, you know, mature shit. Right. But instead, this person was like, oh, you know, look at this car. They's like, oh, I want I want some drugs, some money, some good times. Some da -da -da -da. You get what I'm saying? So they were just kind of in a self-destructive kind of energy before. Yeah. Yeah. And I think they were real committed to their own issues in their own dark sides and they i think they realized that it was really putting them out in the cold and separating them from you or something like that yeah can we confirm that please hi holy spirit Hi, Holy angels yeah ace of swords that's truth baby thank you and it's funny because the next card is make an investment the thing that broke it brought y'all together is this person saying or this this person or people saying you know what i think i'm ready to 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 ask for more mature things now i think i'm ready to handle a business i think i'm ready to handle a healthy relationship i think i'm ready to make an investment okay in this in this loving connection that i have they see it as a real seed of opportunity i feel like they got an opportunity a glimpse of an opportunity to do so and they say you know what that's what i want to do i'm emotionally ready to 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 make this action like their emotions their passions that is literally look at all of these cards they were a page materially in the physical but they, their emotions made them want to act okay and they were a page with their passions but they're ready to work as a team they're like okay i might not be fully formed but i'm ready to be a part of the team for the for the bigger for the bigger purpose for this ten of pentacles for the bigger goal it's like i'm seeing like just chosen people come together ready to to rise to the occasion which is funny because we've been talking about that a lot here on our patreon or i've been touching on it on patreon recently and i've definitely been awakened so i feel y'all uh, so what is this investment? I feel like I'm just right and I'm channeling, so I don't really even have to. Yeah, I feel like in the past where somebody was being very stubborn and stingy with their energy and their resources and what they had because they just didn't want to give. It's like a father not being there for their child, right? And then one day it just clicks. Like, I think I'm ready to be a dad. That's the energy. You get what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. And then out of nowhere, somebody intuitively was like, you know what? I think this person might be ready. Or they might, their intuition is just saying, okay, it's ready. It's time. The world card at the bottom of the deck. Like, it's it's time, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody, you know, there is just, you know, somebody was over here sitting pretty, you know, nine of pentacles, sitting in their lush garden with everything that they need. And this other person is like, okay, I'm ready to give and take so that I can get some of that. And so they had to sacrifice the parts of themselves that was ready to steal from themselves and from you. You know what I'm saying? yeah yeah this person is emotionally mature more mature now and to see that they were doing that to themselves okay stealing from themselves it's just time it's just fate so um what is the next steps that you guys are going to be what are you guys going to be doing next we got down south you guys could be traveling you guys could be traveling or you guys could be you know, just reflecting down south energy reminds me of like downward spiral. The other card that says downward spiral, uh, and just it remind it just gives me like past life regression or just kind of 
time traveling to like a, a, a different time, right? But down south, what is this down south energy? What is the next steps for Virgo viewer in there? connection with this person so we got the hermit card so i feel like hmm i feel like you guys are going to get together have this be beautiful reunion and this emotional and then you guys are going to go on your own and really let that settle like let that reality settle like let it settle into the reality that okay me and this person are close we can talk now we can plan now in a way healthier way and i feel like after you guys reunite you're going to spend some time alone to know how you want to take advantage of such a beautiful relationship and beautiful connection literally you're going to go off on it's like I, I just heard go off into your separate corners like when people are boxing they're like okay go off into your separate corners so it's like you guys are going to have that beautiful session and you're going to go off into your separate corners on your own alone okay and, and you guys might have a i just heard black uh, dark night of the soul so after you guys have this beautiful reunion you guys might have to go reflect and then go pick up the pieces uh in your separate lives so that you can just keep bringing beauty into your life into each other's lives it's like every time y'all come back uh, you, every time y'all call each other or text each other now that y'all have this new found, you know, rekindled relationship, it's like every time y'all talk and every time y'all get together, y'all gonna have a beautiful energy of love to share between the two of you guys. So it's not nothing major that y'all gonna do next except do great things in y'all life and bring love to each other every time y'all connect with each other. It's literally just gonna be an emotional, just um, emotional experience like a beautiful emotionally renewing experience each time i feel like it's going to bring a lot of balance into your life like i think that the energy of it is going to bring you so much bliss and happiness it's literally going to change your vibration so much where well, your life is literally going to start to look and feel different you're going to have different opportunities popping up because you're just in a happier space can we clarify some more of this down down south energy yeah I feel like you're going to be making a lot more um, emotional decisions in a very healthy way. You're going to be able to open up your heart chakra a lot more and make a lot more decisions that are connected to your heart chakra. It's like you're going to feel more invincible with this person back in your life. You're going to be able to make better decisions, more decisions. You're going to be inclined and inspired to just do more, period. You're going to just be filled with so much more hope and passion. You're going to want to just get to creating everywhere and, and letting towers fall around you that just this time that you're like, okay, you're going to be so damn happy and fulfilled. You're going to be like, okay, anything that's coming against this energy has to go. And you're going to be making those decisions very swiftly. It's probably even going to attract you to a romantic situation or just more loving friends and more loving family and just more opportunities to perfect your craft and just make beautiful works of art and beautiful connections. All I see is beautiful connections all i see so that's what you have next like it's just going to be a beautiful just to recap what split you guys apart is be, people falling victim to the to their lower selves they can have anything they were choosing lower vibrational things instead of a healthy relationship with you and what brought y'all together is just fate time they 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 it's time they their time they, they're just it's time for them to make an investment it went out there their time is like their alarm clock went off like okay i'm ready right and the thing that y'all gonna do next is just better shit in y'all life the the love and connection you guys share is just gonna just heighten your reality so much you just have to let the vibe settle see how it's affecting you feel it sense it literally literally connection the connection you guys have the best connections happen when you're fully charged didn't i say that this this reunion is gonna charge you guys up so much. It's gonna like it's gonna give you like if you if this was a video game and life had taken so much energy from you like you know you experience all these lives lost in the within the video game. This this interaction is gonna boost you guys. You guys have like it's like you guys went from low battery to boo powered up. If this was Mario, you guys just ate like. This connection is going to basically give y'all that mushroom effect where you're going to grow into a fucking giant. <laughs> Anything else? Anything else for a Virgo reviewer who are seeing this on Patreon? Any other advice for a Virgo reviewer? Lots of cards, y'all. Y'all got a lot of decisions to make after this. 
natural things that are going to come into your reality. It's going to be so easy to see what's going on. Nature is also going to be your friend so that you can allow this, this high vibration to really integrate into your normal reality so you don't come plummeting down, back down to a lower place, okay? Truth. Allow the truth to set you free. Tap into your abundance. Use your power and ask for help. I love you guys. I hope this helped. I will see you guys next time. Peace.